Subscribe our channel for latest news updates. Beloved actor Bill Murray has a few things to say about Democrats the left is fuming. While most of Hollywood is rushing to defend Democrats and their toxic ideas, Bill Murray has a few things to say. His remarks took everybody by surprise. Liberals are reeling from his truth bombs. For decades, the left has counted on Hollywood for support and promotion. Democratic politicians often benefit from celebrity endorsements. Every election, famous actors, musicians, and producers throw their weight and money at the most liberal candidate. Since the 2016 election, Hollywood celebrities have not shut up about politics. These rich, entitled elitists have the audacity to scold America for voting for Donald Trump. After polluting our movie theaters with all kinds of immorality, they want us to believe they are the moral conscience of our society. As you can expect, these actors have alienated millions of Americans. Longtime fans are now enemies. And, it's all because we are sick of Hollywood's arrogance. But, one beloved actor and comedian is singing a different tune. Bill Murray recently spoke about the current political climate. Breaking from his colleagues, he actually praised the GOP tax cuts, calling them a good thing. During an interview with CNBC's Squawk Box, Murray likened the Trump administration's tax overhaul to that of a high tide raising all votes, and said he believes it has made things easier, at least for the time being. Source, Fox News. I think certainly the changing the tax laws is a great thing for the corporations, it is a fantastic thing, Murray told CNBC. I don't pretend to understand what that will mean in the future in terms of the economy or what the budget will have to do to take care of what people call entitlements. That may or may not work, and I don't know. But, I think in the first step it's made things easier. You'll remember what other celebrities were saying about the tax cuts. They claimed they would actually hurt everyday Americans. Some were parroting the Democrats, calling the cuts Armageddon. Rosie O'Donnell actually tried to bribe two Republican senators, offering them $2 million if they voted no. But, we all knew the truth. The tax cuts are a good thing. Bill Murray seems to be the only Hollywood actor willing to admit that. Millions of Americans have already seen their pay go up. That's not even including the bonuses and other benefits numerous companies have offered. Murray's comments are a break from the lockstep narrative all liberals seem to be preaching. Unlike most of the con artists in Locke, La Land, Murray is willing to express his own opinion. But, what he went on to say about Democrats has liberals roasting in their shoes. He says, no. No I just think the way the Democrats handle things is poor, where they try to pick out little pieces of the population, oh well we represent the Hispanics, we represent the LGBT or something, Murray told CNBC. The 67-year-old comedian expressed how politicians play identity politics, and called out Democrats for not speaking to everyone at once. There's almost a resentment that somehow you're separated, again, by a politician you're my people. I'm in control of you, I represent you. Instead of thinking that each citizen has a right to be respected as a citizen first, under the laws of the country, Murray said. Bill Murray hits the nail right on the head. In just a few short comments, he exposed the entire scheme of the left. It's amazing how so few people can see it. Democrats claim to want to help all Americans. But, in reality, they are just interested in exploiting smaller groups. Their identity politics are the real reason our country is so divided. They have spent decades telling us we are different because of our race, gender, or sexuality. It takes a well-known actor to acknowledge this hypocrisy. He's absolutely right. Democrats want to separate us, generate resentment towards people who are different. Republicans want to treat everyone equally, as citizens under the law. But when they do that, they are branded racist, bigoted, or homophobic. I wonder how many other celebrities, if any, will chime in. What Murray said is no big secret. Yet, the left tries to deny it. They routinely play those games, separating and manipulating Americans. 
Hey, if Peter Vinkman can see it, so can everyone else.